Hello, this is Callum from Chris W Rhodes Car Superstore. Today is going to be a quick video looking at the exterior and the interior of this Ford Fiesta Z Tech Nav that we have in stock. This particular model that we have here comes with upgraded special solid frozen white colour paintwork. And now onto the rest of the vehicle. It also comes with these beautiful 15 inch alloy wheels. I'll open up the vehicle to take a look into the interior. Or as you can see, it comes with these comfortable cloth upholstery seats. And we'll get onto the rest of the interior features a little bit later on into the video. I'll open up the back seat here to show the knee and the leg room. This seat in front is in my driving position and I'm five foot ten. And as you can see, there's still plenty of knee room here for comfortability, but also lots of headroom. Take a look towards the rear of the vehicle here, where you're able to take a look at those rear lights. And they'll also show the size of the boot space as well. Or as you can tell, for a small practical car, you are getting a very good sized boot space here, which does include a little bit of extra storage down below as well. We'll have one look towards the side of the vehicle here, where you're really able to take in that beautiful upgraded paintwork. And as you can tell, there's a couple of swage lines cutting across the vehicle, which gives it a very sporty look. And we'll have one final look towards the front of the vehicle here, where you'll be able to take a look at the full badge, grille and lights. And in the second part of the video, we'll look into the interior. Now let's have a look at the interior. On the right hand side, you have the electric switches for the front windows, as well as the electric mirrors. Down onto the right is where the headlight switch is located. Moving up onto the steering wheel. On the left hand side, you have navigating buttons to control the infotainment system, including a push to talk button. Moving up here onto the dials. I'll quickly turn the vehicle on so we can take a look. As you can tell, there are no problems whatsoever on the startup. On the left hand side is where the rev counter is located. You have a heads up display up top with the fuel gauge shown down below and the miles per hour on the right. Moving on over here to the main infotainment system, as you can tell, the radio option does come with DAB radio included. The vehicle does also come with a SD card based satellite navigation system. There's also an auxiliary option as well as a phone option for Bluetooth connectivity. Here is the main control point for the infotainment system. Moving on a bit further down is where you'll find the buttons for the air conditioning. There's a little bit of extra storage down below as well. There'll be a five speed manual gearbox in the middle here with a little bit more of extra storage down below, including a 12 volt port as well as a USB port. There's also a manual handbrake just alongside space for two cup holders as well. And if you would like any more details about this vehicle that we have in stock, please visit our website at Chris wroads.co.uk Thank you for watching.